Hey everybody, this is Solar Gray from Back in the Deck Productions coming back at you for the first time in a while. And well, we're right back here at Comic Book Sunday, hosted by Mr. Ben Jackendoff. And I am here today with Miss Meriden Villanueva. I got that right, right? Villanueva? Villanueva. Villanueva. So, um, I pulled you aside today to talk to you about the Los, An- the Los Angeles Philippine... Um, oh, Philippine American or <coughs> Los Angeles Philippine International Film Festival. Hey, um, according to our sources, uh, you've got over twenty short films that you guys have pulled. Yes, so we are actually doing two screenings at the LA Philippine International Film Festival. We're opening night with fourteen short films that were produced this summer, as well as thirteen short films that premiered at the LA Asian. Pacific Film Festival in April, so that's a total of 27 short films that we are screening at the film festival, the LA Philippine International Film Festival, now on October 27th and 27th. It's actually a four-day event, so we're blessed to be part of the program with our organization called Film Creative. Wow, so your organization really focus on focuses, as far as my sources tell me, on advancing and empowering the Filipino or the Philippine um, entertainment industry, as it were, film, TV, stage? Absolutely. So thankfully this year, um, I've stepped up as president for the organization. And just like you said, we, we're pretty much a community-driven organization that is dedicated to the advancement and empowerment of Filipinos, Filipino Americans in the entertainment industry so that we can add our voice to the Asian American conversation and experience in Hollywood. So, as you know, there's been a lack of representation, so in order to really counter that is not just wait for someone to hire us, but really create our own content, our own stories, and create our voice here in Hollywood. Oh, fantastic. Uh, like, how long has um, how long has your organization been part of the, the let's call it Asian American section of the film industry, if we will? Sure. So actually, Film Creative was founded um, eight years ago, and many of the creatives were able to network with one another, and they found like, oh, hey, you're also in the entertainment industry, and you're also Filipino. So they started uh, this organization and, and hosted a couple of panel events, workshops, networking events, so that they can provide a platform and space for filmmakers, actors, writers, directors, producers to collaborate and connect with each other. And since then, it's just been growing exponentially. And we're very active on our Facebook, Twitter, and Instagram page. And When people think of Asian film, they have a tendency to only think of Hong Kong. And they forget that, one, Asia is a big place. And the Asian community is very diverse. And everyone has stories to tell. I think our organization is really pushing for more diversity in media and entertainment. And I'm very inspired about, from other organizations that do push for people of color out there. So we want to be part of that as well. And, you know, it helps to have a supportive community of creators that feel just as passionate as you are. I think we are definitely making some noise in Hollywood because we were actually reached out from NBC. CBS and ABC, and we're actually doing partnerships with them to promote and promote their programs. They've really reached out to the, to the Filipino American community and want to be able to share an info session with us to learn about the opportunities that are out there because they do want to create a more accurate world on on the TV screens, films, you know, in theaters, all all of that. So. That is fantastic. Well, that is all the time we have for this interview today. But as we said, if you guys want to find out any more about Ms. Villanueva and the organization, we're going to leave a link down there in the doobly-doo. And remember, if somebody tells you that you can't do anything from art to entertainment to business because of the circumstances of your birth, you just look at them and tell them to take that card and put it back in the deck. This has been Solar Gray. All right, signing off.